Provider! Huh? I don't think you need to film this part, but... Which, by the way, Lincoln, you're going to be the second person outside of my organization to have a Pravada Barreled Age Sumatra, which is a collaboration between AJ Fernandez and Heaven Hill Distillery. Oh, fantastic. I'm very okay. excited to have this, Brian. Um, we aged these cigars for 90 days in Heaven Hill barrels. And uh, I think you're gonna like the result. Bringing these luxury lifestyle products together, and that's what a cigar is. See, I, I, I battle with that back and forth because my thing is, is the craft, and the reason why I'm so big on the craft side of the cigars, who's making them, how they're making them, the real people making them, with their actual, the, 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 the two, 300 hands, that it took to make those is because it is an art form. And I think the further we can make it distinct from, you know, different from the other forms of tobacco, it's, it's good for everything. But for us, I think it's more important to understand this stuff, to focus on the people that are actually making the products, getting the credit they deserve, that kind of thing. And then we went by some banana stand and I'm like, that's from the show. And they're like, no, 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 they got that from here. I'm like, okay, I get it. There's always money in the banana stand. No touching, no touching, no touching. No touching. No touching. No touching. Brick and mortar and the online. I'm hoping that there's enough pie for everybody. That's something that I'm probably most proud of. As much success as the Cigar of the Month Club has had, the yeah. thing I'm most proud of is that LCA, the Limited Cigar Association. And what happened was when COVID came and some of these shops in different states were shutting down, we came up with this idea to do a monthly drop where we shared our audience with them. We have 10,000 you know, raving cigar fanatic members and it was our idea because a lot of these people had bad experiences at their shops. We wanted to kind of reintroduce shops to them now that they knew more about tobacco. And so it worked. In a lot of cases, it worked. I mean, we have over 450 shops across the country that most retailers would tell me I'm crazy. I'm the first online retailer to ever share its audience, its customer base with brick and mortar because I do believe that there is enough for everyone. I don't need to be a billionaire off of cigars. I was already doing just fine. And I think it, for me, my legacy is the thing that will matter the most. Thank you so like, much. I know you got like the haters and all of that and it's just all a bunch of garbage. I, I, was, I like the way you're handling it. I wouldn't talk me. about it too much, right? Sorry, but that's just... I back off, yeah. I, you know, yeah. it's... And Look, I wonder sometimes if it's in the best judgment. These but. guys are coming after you because you're a threat. And you know that, right? But the other people have to figure it out for themselves. Yes. That's, that, and that's the thing about Pravada is while it is a Cigar of the Month Club and while we do collaborate or curate from the masters of our industry, um, we're also a retailer at heart. And so that's what we, I think we try to do. We try to um, uh, create opportunity to, we even created something on our, on our website called Explore. It's Pravada Explore. And you can go there, if you had a cigar that you liked, you can find that cigar in there and then it will spit out a bunch of other things that we think you'll like from uh, whether it be the tasting notes or the tobaccos used or really what it comes down to is the factory because each factory has that stamp. Tyler, yeah. what, what was the piece that we, what were we talking about? Okay, so um, our producer William, uh -huh has me film himself like doing random things he'll be like what? okay guys we're here we're here at this event and blah 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 when we travel when we travel yeah like even any you gotta put that in the video i'll put it put in, it in the video. live here at 
the Cigar and Spirits show here in, uh, where are we? Where are we, Tyler? Uh, we're in Newport Beach, California. Newport Beach, California. We're checking out some of the booths. Yeah. Got Brian Schmooze over there with all of our uh, Pravada members. Got to represent all out there. Love it. Look at that. That whole line is for us. It's an interesting time for us because I'm no longer this like, bam, out of left field. Holy, sh you know, I got to try this. What is this? You know, um, but if you're under the age of 45 and you're entering the cigar world, there's a really good chance uh, that you'll probably end up joining Pravada for a period of time at least. It seems to be a rite of passage with a lot of cigar smokers now. Um, I think the focus on craft cigars, on the actual people making it, and I don't think people in the industry realize what I'm saying when I say that. Like, my members understand who these people are and what different signature stamps they put on their tobacco from a flavors and construction, that kind of thing. Oh, oh shit! shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> so is it the business for you or is it the cigar for you? I, it started with a collecting. And then once I started to have personal relationships with Actually, no, I, it started with the collecting. The collecting made me a fan of, of the brands and the people that were making them and I wanted to learn more. So I read and read and read and read. And I, the, that's a great question. And you know what the answer is? It's the people that make the cigars that I'm, a, that I'm so crazy about. Of course, I 100% love cigars. I can't go a day without smoking three cigars a day. That's what I do every day, maybe four. My, my wife and I smoke cigars every night together. Uh, this is my life, it is my passion, but, the, but that's a really good question because you just made me realize it wasn't necessarily the cigar that I fell in love with. It was the idea that this thing is made by certain people and each one has its own special characteristics. Each factory, each blender has its own special characteristic. And so that's, thank you for that. Make me tired Just running through my mind Wonder if there's peace I can go Run away, run away, run away To your escape Run away, run away, run away Run away, run away, run away You're never too far to run Run away, run away, run away To your escape that you're in a tin can thousands of feet above the ground that you're supposed to be on and there's like I don't know it's like proof that there's a matrix because we can't even get cars right yet there's millions of people flying every day oh and we're in the back of the plane too this is the worst I should have paid for the upgrade damn it Provider!